So we're going to visit something now that is worth four billion pounds. We're traveling to London today, kids. Are you excited? We're going away for a week and it's going to be bloody fantastic. So let's get going. Right, kids, we're here. We've arrived. So today I'm actually helping Joanne set up the caravan. Oh, and I'm going to help by supervising you, Joanne. <laughs> you just crack on. I'm watching the kids. So you're probably wondering what's happened to George's hair. I'm the big elephant in the room. What's happened to my hair? Well, here's a clip of what happened yesterday. George is butchering my head right now. What do you want to be when you're older, George? You want to be hair? <laughs> so I've nipped inside for two minutes, and while George has been outside with the clippers, he's hacked into his own hair. God. George has been alone for five minutes. He's got his hand on the clippers. Right, let's shave it off and get back to the content. Right, guys, it's the first night. Are you excited for your holiday? I've got a fun game for you. Should we play? It's called How Many People Can We Fit in the Toilet? You strip it off. Let's go! Right, I didn't tell you, but the second part of this game, guys, is how long can we stay in the toilet? <laughs> <laughs> We're having a great time! Let's start the timer! It's jokes. <laughs> Toilet can be fun, and if you've enjoyed this content so far, make sure you hit that wake up, make sure you hit that subscribe button, that like button, and continue watching. And that's how you get four people in the toilet. Right, gonna call it a day there. I'll see you in the morning. Good morning. Today we are going on a trip. We're going to London. Let's go. So here we are in London, going through the underground. This is Oliver. Welcome to the channel, Oliver. Just trying to steer this pram everywhere down the underground. Oh, yeah. Crashed into <laughs> Honestly, Oliver, you must be the best looking tour guide I have ever met. Almost as good looking as me. Almost. Almost. Oh, finally, we're outside. I feel like I've been underground for donkeys. So, this is London. There's the shard. So we're just looking for somewhere to go to eat now, aren't we, Joanne? But we're not looking for anywhere too expensive because we're tight as hell. Nice. Right, let's just go. There we are, Weatherspoons. Can't go wrong with the Weatherspoons, can you? Cheapest chips. Right now, you can't see us, but George and I are crossing swords at the toilet. And if you don't know what that means, look in the Urban Dictionary. Oh, wow. That looks delicious. Thank you very much. Well, that was bloody fantastic. Okay. So that ticket there, what we've just bought, is we're going to see the Tower of London. Is that what we're going to see, Ollie? We sure are, Sid. We're going to see the Tower of London. Let's go. So this is the Tower of London. This is where Henry VIII lived. And she survived. She never got her head sliced off. Oh, she did get her head off? Well, she did get her head off. That's unfortunate. She did get her head chopped off. This is marvellous, isn't it? I wonder at what point they decided. I'll tell you what, we're going to move you out now. We're going to turn this into a tourist attraction. I've never been so amazed by a bed. It's probably just from Ikea, to be fair. We have recreated this royal bed. Ah, I knew it. That's just from Ikea, that is. Have you seen the people in that uniform? Ollie told me there were beef eaters, which I know them as beef eaters. But it says the Yeoman Wardens, which are the monarch's guardians of the tower. And basically their uniform costs around £4,000. £4,000? And they look horrendous. You can pick up a better suit from Prima for a tenner. Imagine just being like Henry VIII right now, like just out here, see, watching the London bus go by. Wow, now that is impressive. Imagine trying to find your wife in there though. Be mental. Oh, I've lost my car keys. Joanne, where are you? I'm trying to find my car keys. So we're going to visit something now that is worth four billion pounds. Did you got to look at it? I mean, that was a sneaky recording. But as if that was worth four billion pound? Well, that was bloody fantastic. Next stop, Big Ben. Ah, there we are, Big Ben. Here's a little fun fact for you. That's, uh, the whole building is not actually called Big Ben. It's actually the bell inside that's called Big Ben. See, you learn things on this channel. Hit that subscribe button and that like button. And here we are. Buckingham Palace. I mean, that's like the worst shot I could have done, isn't it? Right, let's try that again. Take two. Here we are, Buckingham Palace. 
Right, let's go back to the caravan. We're back. I'm absolutely knackered. It's time for bed. Oh, morning. I've had eight hours sleep. And I'm ready to crack on with the day. What an awesome day. Let's have a bacon sandwich. There we are, bacon sandwich. Lovely jubbly. That bacon sandwich was bloody beautiful. You know what I fancy doing today? I fancy going to the good old Mucky pub. So here we are, out on a little bit of a dog walk, going to the pub, fantastic, because we're going to get ourselves a nice, well-earned pint. Aha, uh -huh. here we are. The pub. Oh my, this pub looks delightful. Bloody closed, didn't it? So George got a new wand yesterday, didn't you, George? George got Harry Potter's wand. So we're going to perform some magic. What we're going to do is we're going to make the corn disappear. Right, George, you have to listen to me very, very carefully, right? In order to make the corn disappear, okay? I'll go and set the corn up and you cast the spell, all right? Right, George, are you ready? Yeah. Let's do this. Make the corn disappear. Let's go. George, where's your dad gone? I made it disappear. Come on, kids, let's go to the park. So here we are at Stevenage, where are we? Stevenage Park, we're at Stevenage Park. Oh, Stevenage Park? Oh, where are we? We're at a park. We're going down the big slide. Look at the size of this thing, it's brilliant. Whoa. Ready, Ada? Let's do this. Let's go! Woo! Come on, let's get the hell out of here. My goodness, this is the most picturesque park I've ever been to. Oh, this park is just incredible, isn't it? Oh, look, you want there's a geese. It's not a geese. Yeah, it is. It's not a geese, it's a goose. One is a goose, many is a geese. And then if there's lots, it's a flock. God, it's like going out for a walk with Wikipedia. Fishing must be booked in advance. Otherwise, you will be fined copious amounts of money. God, this guy's took his book into the extreme, honey. He? He's moved in. Hi, that's, uh, that's a lot of uh, moo hens. That's a lot of... That's a lot of... That's a... Will you just let me... That's a lot of moo hens there. This guy's trying to catch air. What the heck? <laughs> Did you see that? Well, that was bloody fantastic. Let's head back to the caravan. I'm bored. I'm ready to play a game, George. This game is called Balance the Corn. We're gonna get that corn over there and you've got to balance it on your head. Only to be played by Balance the Corn professionals. Let's go. Right, you ready? Balance the corn. You're doing a great job there, George. Now you have to see how long you can keep the corn on your head for. All right. Well, I have a sit down. There you go. Kids entertained. Right, gonna call it a night there. I'll see you in the morning. Because I'm so popular, the kids are just fighting over who wants to sit next to me, aren't you, kids? Who wants to sit next to me? Do you want to sit next to me? Yeah, I want to sit next to me. <laughs> so I'll sit, I'll sit next to Ada. Let me sit next to me. Mommy, sit next to me. Mommy, sit next to me. Mommy, sit next to me. No! Mommy, sit next to me. Mommy, sit next to me. I've compromised. I'm sitting in the middle. What are you doing? Do one. We're just packing up the caravan now and these kids have been an absolute nuisance as usual. Oh, do you know what I've realised we haven't done? We haven't done an Instagram snap. Come on, get over there into the nice green section of the, uh, the caravan pitch. Ah, get ready to the photo, smile. There, done. Just closing up the old caravan. We've had a fantastic time. I have changed my t-shirt, ready for the journey home. That's not a continuation error. But we've had a fantastic time, haven't we, Joanne? Let's get the hell out of here. And if you've enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button, because that really helps me out. Hit that like button. All right, I'll see you in the next upload. I'll tell you what, this wand is more incredible than I thought it was. Are you ready for this? George, go and get me into the beer. Ah, oh, super duper. See, bloody fantastic. <laughs> Subscribe.
we'll see you later.